Hi, I'm Colin Engel, CEO and co-founder of iRobot, here with another Cool Stuff video. In this edition, I'm looking at how some amazing robots are helping us with the challenges we face this year. During the pandemic, we've seen robot technology emerge in new areas and unlock new possibilities, whether it's cleaning, delivery, disinfecting, or as a social outlet, robots are emerging as one of the heroes of the COVID-19 pandemic. While we've been locked down, robots have been stepping up. Let's check them out. With people trying to limit how much time they spend out in public, Starship Technologies' self-driving delivery robot is helping the cause by bringing food and other essential goods right to the front door. The six-wheeled robots have been in use in select cities for a couple of years now and recently found a new home on a dozen college campuses in the U.S., allowing students to get food safely without going out. At James Madison University, for example, a fleet of 40 have been making 300 deliveries per day since they were launched in August. George Mason University now has a fleet of 25 on its campus, and they saw a spike in breakfast orders once students became aware of the service. Looks like they found the right market for this robot, even beyond the pandemic. Food assistance has become even more urgent as a result of COVID. To continue providing that essential service, the Greater Boston Food Bank needed to assure that everything going out of their warehouses was properly disinfected. That challenge was solved by our second robot. The food bank teamed up with MIT's Computer Science and Artificial Intelligence Lab and Ava Robotics to design a completely new system which not only disinfects surfaces, but also neutralizes coronavirus in the air. The robot combines a custom UVC light fixture designed at CSAIL, integrated with Ava Robotics' mobile robot base. It can map the food bank's warehouse and navigate safely between defined waypoints in other areas. What is really cool is that this system's customizable. It can also be applied to a warehouse, grocery store, school, or any other space where cleaning could put workers at risk. The robot doesn't move fast, but gets the job done. It can cover a 4,000 square foot warehouse in just about a half an hour, keeping all the essential supplies moving at the food bank. In times of crisis, we're seeing that existing robots can provide the ideal platform for a quick development of a solution. Our last robot, the LHF Connect, LHF, uh, low-hanging fruit, is a prime example of that, as it leverages a Roomba platform to go way beyond vacuuming. Built on our standard i7 robot vacuum, the LHF Connect enables people who are in the hospital or in quarantine to safely connect with loved ones or medical professionals. The robot also allows medical staff to remotely provide basic aid, like administering medicine. This was a rapid fire development, especially for the early days of COVID, when doctors were still learning about the disease. The coalition that created the robot designed it as an open source project so it could be replicated by others at a relatively low cost. I love seeing Roomba serve the greater good, and I was proud that iRobot could play a part in developing this solution. Hats off to the innovative builders that took a great idea and made it a reality when we needed it most. So there you have it, three cool robots, some great achievements in robotics during some very challenging times. In fact, robots are making such an impact that we'll look at how a few others are helping during COVID in our next installment of Cool Stuff. Until then, keep on building.